Hello my planty friends! Welcome back to my channel. This is Miss Plantaholic and today I'll be sharing with you a house plant tour in my bedroom. And these are a couple of my plants that I have here in um, my bedroom. So let's begin with my string of hearts right here. I got this a couple of months ago and at the time I got it, it was not trailing yet but right now as you can see it has grown so much and it's trailing very very long it's almost at the floor right there and the uh, one below it is my Sansevieria. I still haven't repotted it and I think it's due for a repotting because I can see at the back that it's so crowded there. So one of these days I'll repot this to a bigger pot. Next one is one of our favorites. It's this Monstera Deliciosa and right now it has like a baby leaf sprouting right there I have actually repotted this in Lekka because I noticed some of the leaves were having some brown spots and some of the um, edges are turning brown so I wanted to see if that will be resolved if I repot it here in Lekka and so far it's doing well I just re re when I repotted this in Lekka I would say a week ago and I have my mist running here to add humidity in my bedroom I love this one you can use it as a night light um, during bedtime and this one can run up to eight hours and it helps you know add moisture to the air too especially during winter time when it's very dry next to my humidifier is my succulent I don't know the exact name of this succulent but I usually have my succulents in my patio but this one I kept it indoors just because I love it it, it has this very uh, pretty pink foliage and some of the leaves are kind of yellow and this one I got this one at a local nursery um, that I usually go to and so far it's holding on to the indoor environment next to our tour is my Hoya Australis that one I got it in through Facebook marketplace I was browsing through Facebook and something popped up of the uh, Facebook marketplace and I this is just few minutes from my house so I got it I actually have to actually have to um, put some wiring on it because it's a trailing plant so what I did was I got this wire and make I made a heart shape out of it and I let the the vine trail through it So right now it's growing okay growing well I have the other end here and that's my Hoya Australis one of my Hoya collections the next to our bedroom tour is this wall shelf up here I have this um, Pilea 
the pair of mildews and this is my second one when I found this at Home Depot I'm like oh good jar is too cute and I think I can use another Pelea and this one have grown so much too there's so much baby leaf growing second one I think it's um I don't know the exact name but seems like it's uh like a tradescantia um because of the pink and green um, variegation on the leaves that one have grown not much but i see some sprouting over there next one is my kalisha repents i only got this as a cutting from um, a seller on facebook marketplace and when i first had this this was more fuller but right now it's not really doing well i don't know maybe because um the cutting was probably not as good maybe it doesn't have much roots when um the seller repotted it and this one right here is a fluminensis it belongs to the tradescantia family and this one is doing really well let me see if i can focus it it has grown so many leaves since i got it i actually got this at the same time when i got this repents now on this section right here I have my three favorite trailing plants first one is the Decidia ovata or ovovata this one I also got from a Facebook market marketplace seller I love how this resembles like the watermelon pepperonia looks like a watermelon and it has grown so much too since I got it next one is a another pepperonia and this one is called ruby glow I love this one because it has this maroon foliage at the back and there's just so many baby leaves sprouting right now next one is my syndapsis and this one i only got this as a cutting as well and so far it has trailed a little bit and i see some baby leaf right there right now this one the leaves are curling just because i think i forgot to water it for a while so i just watered this earlier so hopefully this one will sprout up and be back to its normal um shape then i'll bring you along my bathroom and over here i have my syngonium um this is also called an arrowhead plant and this one have some pink kind of like a blush pink and green foliage right there i love this one it's so pretty this is actually my third syngonium i have propagated some stems out of this one and i gave it to my friend and she told me that it's doing well and i think um the the roots are holding well and i only propagated it in water which is amazing the last one on our tour are my baby baby pepperonias um cactus mini mouse and a succulent from my patio i don't know the exact oh i think it's the elephant bush i'll just take a close up here so this one right here it's a elephant bush this one is a succulent but i don't know the name this one right here is a 
Peperonia. And I think this is the emerald green. I'm not quite sure. I love how the foliage of this one is. Kind of reminded me of the watermelon peperonia. And this one right here is another peperonia. And I forgot the name of this one. But just like with the other uh, peperonia that I showed you, this one has this watermelon-like foliage. So it's really cute. I got both at the same time and the last one is this very cute mini mouse cactus as you can see the shape is kind of like um, mini mouse and it has that pink flower on the top and at the back there's another one so this is really cute I love it this frame right here is not actually for plants but I just improvised it I thought it's a good way to showcase this um, mini babies right here so they're doing really well in it's actually near a window so they have like light coming through all day so that's pretty much it for my bedroom tour so till the next till the next vlog um, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and i hope to see you in our next vlog keep the plant love and keep on planting